I'm here with world champion Mikey Garcia. How does that sound? Sounds good, right? Sounds pretty good. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, it, it, it sounds good, and, and the belt looked nice, too. Yeah, and you brought a suit out, looking like a champ and everything. So, <laughs> tough fight coming up against Juan Manuel Lopez. Your thoughts on him as an opponent, Southpaw, two-time world champion, tough puncher, and a pretty tough opponent for your first title offense. Uh, definitely. Um, you know, he's definitely a, a, a world champion. He's proven himself uh, in the past to be one of the best in the, in the sport, and you know, it's a tough first title defense, but I'm um, welcoming it with open arms. I got to prove myself um, by taking these kind of fights, and I'm very happy to be, you know, presenting that, that opportunity to give the fans a little more and, and, and give everybody a little more to see. Yeah, I think we were talking about that earlier, and in terms of giving the fans a little bit more, they, they saw another side of you against Toledo. Um, now they're going to see, I think, what we talked about earlier is the toughness, because he, Juanma brings that out of his bonus. He's a tough guy, and you'll get a chance to show your toughness probably, I think, more than ever before in this fight. I think so. Uh, you know, the kind of fighter that Juanma is, is that kind of fighter. You know, he, He's tough, rugged. Um, you know, he gives everything 110% every single night. And that'll bring my, you know, toughness out and, and show everybody the kind of fighter that I am as as a world champion now. So, you know, I think I'm expecting a very good fight from him because um, I think he's really hungry to be where I'm at, and that's going to allow me to work harder. And sometimes uh, the best fighters aren't necessarily the strongest fighters, but they're the smartest fighters. And he did say in today's press conference that uh, you might not be the strongest guy he's ever faced, but you're the most intelligent. How can you use your intelligence as an advantage in this fight against somebody like Juan Ma? Well, we're going to try to uh, prepare for many scenarios, um, not just, you know, technical fighting on the outside. i got to make sure that I'm ready to go to war if it has to or put pressure on him. Um, he can also move. He knows how to box, so he might decide to stick on the outside and and try to go for a distance. You know, a 12-round unanimous decision. So I gotta maybe put pressure. So I got I gotta make sure I'm ready for everything. But uh, you know, I am a smart fighter. I like to be smart in the ring, and he knows that. So it's, it's, it might turn out to be a very technical fight. You know, you never know. And lastly, we're here in Dallas. It's pretty cool. You fought here before, but not in this sort of arena, not on this big venue. Your thoughts about fighting here in Dallas? You have a lot of fans out here supporting you today. We, we definitely do have a lot of fans, and, and it's a big uh, boxing, you know, community, you know, and, and Texas is a big boxing state, so we're, we're very happy to be here and, um, you know, give the fans, you know, another great night of boxing. I know you will. Thank you, Mikey. Appreciate you. You're welcome. Thank All you. All right. With Mikey Garcia, I'm Christina Poncher for TopRank.com.